Well, good morning. It's Tuesday, which means it's Nat's day off. So we've decided to head down towards a row white beach. We're going to take Shadow a quick walk on the beach. We've had quite a lot of bad weather in the last few days. Phuket's had some quite bad storms, very high winds, and the forecast is for more bad weather to come. But the sun's come out at the moment, so we're going to snatch it while we can. Head down there. I'm going to do a quick run through of the Nayarm area on the way back which is in the Rawai district because there has been quite a lot of businesses opening up in that area so we shall take a quick look at that area on the way back as well but for now let's head to the beach Okay, so we've just arrived at Arawai Beach. We're going to take a short walk down the beach area with Shadow. Just give her a little bit of exercise. Sort of dodging in between the showers. As I mentioned earlier, we have had some bad weather. As you can see, lots of boats moored up. Not many trips going on at the moment because of the storm conditions. The boats are obviously staying in. Very advisable. Not really where you want to be when the weather's bad on a boat in the middle of the ocean. It's actually quite nice when the sun's out. The last few days, terrible. Wind, rain. But it is the rainy season. A lot of people ask me what the weather's like. Well, it's very, very changeable at this time of year. The weather can change very quickly. One minute, beautiful blue sky. Well, I wouldn't say beautiful blue sky, but a little bit of cloud and then absolutely torrential rain. There's Shadow having a play. She hasn't been to the beach for about two or three weeks because of the weather being so bad. Oh. oh. It's only a boat, girl. A boat starting up. So as I mentioned, we're gonna have a qu quick walk down Rawai Beach. It's not the best beach here on the island, but it's okay to walk Shadow. A little bit of sand. The tide is in today, so it's not very wide at the minute. And then from here, we're going to have a ride through an area that I call Nahum. Now, some people say that it's a Rawai, and it is in the Rawai district, but I tend to call it Nahum because it's very close to the Nahum beach area. But I have had people disagree with me in the past and say, well, actually, that's Rawai. And they are right because it is the Rawai district. But personally, I call it Nay. Nahum Town. I've always referred it to the, as that. Nat's always referred to it as Nahum Town because when I used to first come to Phuket, I used to ask Nat where we are and she would say Nahum and that's how it's come about. Now, whether you want to call it Nahum or Rawai, part of Rawai, this is, for me, this is what I call Rawai, the actual town area where we are now by the beach. But Rawai is a very big district, as I say, and there's lots of smaller areas in there. It doesn't really matter, but we're going to take a look at a different part of Rawai um, and we'll see what's going on there because I went through the area last week, I think it was, and there was a lot of changes, a lot of new businesses opened up and it was quite busy. So I thought, well, we'll go and have a look during the day, see what it's like, and then I may go back in the evening time and take the video camera with me because I hadn't got the camera with me on that particular evening so I couldn't video it. So that's what we're going to do very very soon.
Shadow exercise, huh? Oop, I'm sinking in the sand. <laughs> Go on then, let her have a scoop. Oh. Good girl. <laughs> <laughs> Tired now. <laughs> okay, so we've been down the beach about half an hour now, 40 minutes. We're going to make our way home, but we're going to go through what I call the Nahalm area. Take a look at what's happening there. Nat's going to be doing the filming because, of course, I'm driving the bike and Nat can't drive Charlie even though she can ride a scooter. For some reason she can't ride Charlie, I don't know how that works. Still trying to get her to learn how to use Charlie. It's not that hard to be honest. If you can ride a scooter you certainly can drive Charlie but she's always, uh, no, no, can't do it. So still trying to get her to do it. Hey no, sweetheart, trying to get you to learn how to ride Charlie. Huh? No? Don't like her? No, she don't like her. Oh, it's the shaking she don't like. Uh, I don't find it shakes. As long as you hold the steering wheel, there's no shaking. <laughs> Looks like there's some people going out on a trip. The weather's not too bad at the minute, but I definitely wouldn't want to be going on a trip just at the minute because they have give storm warnings out for the next couple of days. They're saying until Thursday. Oh, shadow chasing a crab there. And you go. So they're going out. Perhaps they're just going over to the island just over there. What's that island called, Nat? Kohei. Kohei. So that one over there, Nat thinks he's called. She's not sure. She's telling me she's not sure. But maybe they're just going over there. Short, short trip. Uh, she can't see the little crab there. She's missed it. There. She normally has them for breakfast. Oh, there she goes. Come on you, Trouble. Let's go. Okay, well we've just seen this board, so I think it's Bon Island that I've just been showing you. The Nat said it was called something else. You can see there's a few islands there. And the trouble is now the guy thinks we're going to go on a trip. <laughs> we're not, we're just going in Charlie. So. Which one's that one, Nat, over there? That's the guy. Mm. Oh, Coral Island, it, that one. Coral, it means Kohei. Oh, that's the big one over there, yeah? And then this one here? Bon, bon, Island. bon Island, okay. Okay, Coven Cap, thank you. Okay. How much is it to go to Co Coral Island? Bon Island, uh, go and back 1,000. 1,000 baht to go and back. Yeah. What about Coral Island? Kohei, uh, 1,500 each. Is that each or boat? Uh, up to eight people. Yeah. Okay. okay, so it's 1,000 to go to Bon Island, 1,500 to Coral Island yeah. for the boat. Yeah. Up to eight people. Okay, cob and cap. Okay, so let's go and take a quick look at the Neholm area. Oh, 
Okay, well we've just made it home and as you can see it's raining so as I mentioned earlier just have to grab the moments in between the showers so we've had a great time at the beach we've had a quick ride through Nahalm and now back home well I hope you've enjoyed this quick video little ride around on a Tuesday hour day off so I will catch you as always very soon